Society, the Children's Charity of Texas. Um, this is typically the point in an award ceremony or in a show where the big way for an organization or a paid employee or somebody will come up and actually introduce your MC. Well, for those of you that don't know, Jody Dean actually filled in for us at the very last minute last year. And he went back on the air and talked about us the very next day. And because of that, someone heard his speech about variety. And we found out about Harry, who's sitting right here beside me. And what I want to do tonight, instead of introducing Jody, who deserves an introduction, but what I want to do is introduce somebody that deserves one even more. Ladies and gentlemen, Gary Shackleton. I would like to thank Jody Dean, or else I wouldn't be having this chair right now. Ladies and gentlemen, Jody Dean and Gary. get some pinstripes put on there and I mean you'll you'll be good to go. It's nice to nice to see you. Uh wow. Didn't think that was gonna happen. Where'd get where where Lance, where'd you go? You rat. Don't do that to me. Uh good evening everybody. How about this Texas weather we got for this little uh, party of golf? It's almost good enough to play a World Series game, don't you think? It's a pleasure to be here this this year. Uh, I gotta tell you, last year Gary Cogill was supposed to be the host of this evening, and I think Gary got sick. He had a bad case of the blue or something like that. They called me out, and, and I've always heard about variety, and I knew a little bit about it, but just enough to be dangerous. And I came out last year and walked in here and saw what the details were, and the particulars are, and, and exactly how you touch lives and how you serve people and how you really change lives. And I met some of the young young men and women, the boys and girls who were here that evening, and I couldn't go back on the radio and do anything except talk about this organization because it is so cool and, and this is such a fun evening and it's such a beautiful place. And how about a hand for our hosts here at the Four Seasons, all the servers and bar staff. And they really, really, really are great. And if you if you stayed here before, you know, if you've never stayed here before, you're just visiting, this is a really fun place. So we hope you'll come back and, and uh, enjoy the Four Seasons another time. Um, like I said last year, I, I learned more in about an hour and a half of being with you than, uh, than I knew in my entire experience when it came to variety. It was not hard to convince me to come back this year. Uh, for those who don't know my story in brief, my sister was uh, profoundly disabled uh, and died when I was six years old. She was 12 and I was just telling Betty, uh, a friend who's with me tonight, that if my sister were alive today, what a world she would have before her because of wonderful things like these uh, freedom cycles and orthotically designed chairs and all kinds of treatment and therapy and, and knowledge that we have now that we didn't have back in the 50s and 60s. And, and I look at that and I don't feel bitter about it or deprived in one, one small sense of whatsoever because I feel like that the progress that we make and the, 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 the strides that we celebrate here tonight, she was a part of. And the things that uh, my mom and dad did for and with her make a difference for people like Garrett and all the other folks here this evening. And that's why I'm here tonight, is to thank them. Uh, good heavens. Uh, want to thank everybody again for being here. Good luck at the golf tournament tomorrow. Thanks again to the people who prepared to serve the food this evening, to Lance and everybody with Variety, uh, our DJ this evening. Truly, this is one of the, one of the wonderful untold treasures of the uh, philanthropic landscape of Dallas-Fort Worth and nationally. It's just an incredible organization.